Okay, he's dead now. That's cool. <laughs> uh, I'm at the place where I need to be, where I think I should be. I definitely need to take some ammo away. Or, uh, get some ammo, I should say. Sorry. Not take some ammo away. Where, where I'm at, we need to get some more ammo at the respawning ammo place. Fuck you guys. You guys suck. Suck. You guys suck. No? Really? Okay. Lighting you on fire. Lighting you on fire. And also lighting you on fire. Or not. Warblade. Bang. Okay. Uh, okay, I guess this is the weapon I'll be using for now. For at this moment in time. Heading down here. I don't know what's down here. Oh, I do know what's down here. Alright. This is where I'm going to be off-screening, so... Oh my god, stay away from those turrets. Woo! Oh my god, I'm lucky I saw that. I would not have seen that if I wasn't looking at it. I would have just kept going. If I had not seen that, I would have started flipping. I would have been like, oh my god, what's shooting me? Ah! 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 Anyways... So clearly this is where health and ammo respawn. I'm going to be taking a break and grabbing my health and ammo and giving my voice to rest because I've been talking for so long. So I'll see you guys when I have full ammo and more specifically, more shredder ammo. See you guys then. Alright guys, welcome back. I accidentally uh, took out this thing right here and I also died in, uh, while I was getting my... Uh, ammo back up because I decided to walk off the edge because I decided I had an itch at the edge of my ear again and instead of taking off my headset I decided to itch under my headset and kept walking forward. So that's my bad. Anyways, guys are going to respawn when you destroy things. So be ready and listen out for when people are respawning. See? Look. Take out your firestorm. Kill this guy. Continue with your job. I think this will work. I'm not sure. Another guy respond, I think. I heard something. Maybe I heard some health. Because I picked it up. You always want to be careful. You can never be too careful, let me say. Alright, so I definitely heard somebody shooting at me. So it was this guy. Definitely heard somebody shooting at me. Continuing on with my shredder rape. Bang. Oh, somebody shoot. Somebody from behind. Hey there. Oh, losing health. Nope, okay, we're good. Taking out this one. I think that's the last one. That is the last one. So now all the field generators are, in fact, done. There's no more of those. Uh, where's that guy who's shooting at me now? There he is. There. Um, I think that just sums up this first half of the level. I think we're pretty much done with it. Um, if not completely, just about. We're getting close. I know that. But I don't know how to get out of here still, so that's kind of bad. Um, there's got to be something. How do you get out of here? Oh, that's how. Okay. As soon as that shit opens, I'm gonna hop on through. And there's our new weapon, and here's the new Weapons with Shots. Welcome back to yet another episode of Weapons with Shots. Your number one source for all Turok 2 weapons. With Shots. And now here is your legit host, Shots Rocks, to present to you the highly unnecessary, ridiculously overpowered, and ultra-violent weapon in today's episode. The Scorpion Missile Launcher. It's a missile launcher! What the fuck do I have to explain? And now that we're back, we're gonna continue doing what we, uh, last left off, um, doing. Which, I don't know what that was. Maybe you guys do. Okay, I'm trying to remember. I saw barriers somewhere. I don't remember where at all, though. Um, maybe it was back here. Could have been. Could have been. Should have been. Would have been. Could be. I don't remember exactly where it is, so pardon me if I end up looking around for a bit, but we can't progress until we get that third and final key. Um, yeah. That's pretty much how this is going to go. 
This last little bit is going to be me looking for the key. Could be back up here. I want to see why not. I'm just going to continue looking for it until I can get it. And we're going to test out the uh, scorpion. It's very effective against these guys. It's very effective. It's a very strong weapon. Um, if you can get it to hit properly, you can probably, most of the time, grab the Gorious Death from uh, whoever you're attacking. I'm, I went up there, and that's where we got the Purple Eagle Feather. I've been here. This is coming back from getting the Purple Eagle Feather. I just kind of got to backtrack for a bit, figure out where... Uh, figure out where I need to go and kind of evaluate it like a smart person. Let's see. Um, no, I've been there. I've been in this area, but there's no harm in double checking ever. Never f see harm in double checking where you've been, especially in this kind of a level because everything's kind of a bit confusing, looks almost the same. The only really difference is, is that the hallways are color coordinated uh, for each different little area you're in. So that's basically how we've been uh, navigating this area, knowing that yellow is the closest to the last part of this level. Um, maybe we go this way? I doubt it. But there's an elevator here. We've already been in that elevator. Let's try going this way. Up here, maybe? definitely been here it's not here uh this way we've been here i'm gonna try uh well hmm I could try the elevator i think i'm gonna try the elevator just in case you can never be certain in this game and i'm never certain in this game so i would rather test out the uh elevator as opposed to not testing out the elevator Although, I'm sure it's just going to be a waste of time and all that's going to end up happening is I get back to the place I was at before. Okay. So, yeah, I did go in a circle, guys, so there was really no point of going into that area. You guys are probably ripping your hair out saying, DON'T GO THAT WAY! DON'T GO THAT WAY! I went that way anyways. So, obviously, I definitely have to backtrack a little bit more. Probably to the purple area, and I'm just going to double check all the uh, corridors. Um... I'm just going to keep recording, and depending on how tedious and long it gets, I may do some editing, depending. So we'll see. I, I might even just look it up eventually if I get too sick and tired of searching for it. Okay, you guys dead. Uh, no, I don't want to go that way. Not that way either. Definitely picking that plasma round up. I think I want to use the flamethrower, so I'll just keep it out. Let's continue going backwards. Not backwards. Yeah, backwards. Not progressing. Ooh. Ooh don't do that. Um. Oh. Ooh. Wait. Um. I didn't even take that. I didn't even take back the key or the uh, purple feather, did I? No. I guess this is all right. I guess it's all right to get lost sometimes because I have to go over there now. So that's okay. That's all right then. And I don't remember what this one is, but if I if I'm thinking correct, I think it's the ex pretty much the same as the leap of faith. It's just a leap of faith, just much slower and gayer. If I'm not mistaken, which I could be, I'm not sure. It might be, it might be, it might be wrong. Who knows? Got to turn this feather in anyways, though, and we're gonna do it. While I wipe my face off with this towel, you guys can watch this cutscene because I'm sweating like a fuck. All right, let's grab that talisman. It's called Whispers. Um, I'm not totally certain on what that does, but I'm pretty sure based off of uh, things I've read, it's basically the same as the Leap of Faith, which is pretty lame. I wish they would have came up with something new, but you know, I can't, can't really do much about it. 
Lord, give me a sign. I really need to talk to you, Lord. Since the last time we talked, the walk has been hard. Now I know you haven't left me, but I feel like I'm alone. I'm a big boy now, but I'm still not grown. Yes, I've been this way. Didn't do much for me going this way. At all. Hmm. Maybe if I just hop, I'll just look through the water. Maybe I'll find something. Who knows? Keep swimming. Swimming! Alright, in here again, through the hall, up the hall, around the hall, in here, but there's nothing because I already destroyed it. Whew, this is a hard thing to find. Holy crap. I'm sorry I'm wasting so much time looking for it, too. Jesus. Who could the fuck could it be? It's not underwater. Probably not, anyways. I don't remember it being underwater. Uh, let's head back up. Mm hmm. Hmm. Couldn't be in an invisible wall, could it? I don't know. Uh, let's, I guess let's just check this place out a bit. Explore. Adventure. ETC, ETC. Um, Cerebral Boar. Going this way, I think, is a big fat no-no, right? Yeah, this is a big fat no-no. Going this way is also a big fat no-no. Going this way is definitely a big fat no-no because this brings me too far, uh, I'm not mistaken. Oh, there's another way to go. Oh, this is where I'm supposed to be. Uh, I'm such a stupid. Oh my goodness. I'm an idiot. This is where I need to be. Right here. If it's too long, I'll just edit all that crap out. Like if it's a video of adventuring, then I'm just taking that out because we've already adventured. I've already done my adventuring. Uh, where's that key? Where's that key? Oh, is it this way? Yeah! Nope. Okay, cool. Shredder. Very useful. Hey! Okay, that's kind of gay. Taking out the plasma rifle. Bam! There you go. Now that place should be open. Yeah! And there's the final key. Now we can move on. Holy mother. Oh, guess not. <coughs> <coughs> Holy man. Hmm. Oh, hey, come on. There's enough of me to go around, son. There's enough of me to go around. Alright. Gonna head out now. We can go to the next part of the level. Holy man. I'm stoked. We can finally leave this junk piece of crap computer place. God dang, right? Holy, we've been in here for so long. I'm ready to see some new change. In the name of Jesus!